Good morning and thanks for joining us. I wanted to start out with a look at our rain for the month. We've had measurable rain every day since last Wednesday, and some of these daily rain totals were nearing over half an inch. Well, the month of August in Springfield is running almost five inches in the bucket, which is about two inches above normal. And I've, I've heard lots of conversation out in the Ozarks of, wow, my lawn is so green. It's usually not green this time of year. We've had some decent rain, especially for the summer. Again, we're about two inches. Which is above average for the month in Springfield, well above average in West Plains with over seven inches for the month, and above average in Joplin as well with over five inches. And for the summer, so since June 1st, we've got rain totals either at or a little bit above average. We're running close to average in Springfield for the entire three months of summer and above average in West Plains and Joplin. So that's the latest look at some of the rain so far. We've got clear skies out there this morning. It's 65 degrees, it's calm, it's comfortable. It's Feels nice. Temperatures about five to ten degrees cooler now than they were this time yesterday. It's 65 degrees in Springfield, 59 in Branson, 60 in Rolla, and 57 in Clinton. Dew points in the upper 50s and lower 60s. It's what's having it feel so nice. We've got that pleasant, drier, more comfortable air coming in on that muggy meter map. And that's why it's going to feel really nice as you head out to the bus stop. Our front from yesterday, again, well to the south and east, taking that summery air mass with it. Cooler, drier air continuing to fill in on north winds, and we'll keep it that way as we head through the afternoon. So mostly sunny skies all day. Temperatures in the uh, upper 70s and lower 80s again. Pleasant and below average. Really quiet on future cast, 83 degrees today. Clear and comfortable again tonight. We drop to 62 degrees, and then by tomorrow, a couple of clouds, 86 degrees. I think the rain holds off though until Friday. We'll have our next front roll through by Friday and Saturday with a couple of showers and storms possible both Friday and Saturday uh, and then uh, we'll start to dry out Sunday into Monday. So we'll have that second half of the holiday weekend be a little bit drier. Next thing that we're watching is Tropical Storm Dorian. It is uh, approaching Puerto Rico this morning and will likely impact the island later on today. Right now it has 60 mile per hour winds. Again, it's a very strong tropical storm. It could near hurricane conditions as it passes through Puerto Rico today. Hurricane warnings in effect for the entire island as it impacts them uh, by later on today to tonight. And then it skirts the Dominican Republic. Then, as we head towards the holiday weekend, it looks like it will have an opportunity to strengthen in the southern Atlantic and then. Uh, take aim at Florida, possibly as a hurricane, as we head towards the Labor Day holiday weekend. 83 degrees today, mostly sunny, cool, and uh, we'll have some north winds at 5 to 10 miles per hour. 62 overnight, cool, crisp, and comfortable again. 86 degrees tomorrow, warmer on south and west winds, a little bit stickier too, but still, again, really pleasant for this time of year. Uh, we're looking at a couple of showers and storms possible both Friday and Saturday. Temperatures in the lower 80s there with some more clouds. We'll have a couple of clouds on Sunday, maybe a shower or two, but it looks like we'll continue to dry out towards the uh, Labor Day holiday, 86 degrees and mostly sunny.